let Penguin get away. There's more I need to ask him. Balcony. The device Deathstroke was using should do the trick. from Deathstroke could be useful here. Alfred, get GCPD to take a look at the final offer. More to Dixon Docks. They'll find Slade Wilson tied up and waiting for them, along with some of Penguin's illegally obtained weapons. Uh, another anonymous tip? Will do, sir. Oppressed citizens of Gotham, your cries for help have been heard. I am Anarchy, voice of the people, here to save you from the plague of corruption that now infests this once proud city. Those hired and elected to keep us free and safe won't lift a finger. And why would they? They've been bought and paid for, encouraged to turn a blind eye. If they won't act, I will. At dawn's first light, the sources of Gotham's ruin will be destroyed. Now, back to your regularly scheduled programming of propaganda and consumerist garbage. As if there isn't enough going on tonight. I should hurry to Lacey Towers before the cops destroy all the evidence from the crime scene Hello, Penguin Brad. mentioned. I was hoping to get a minute of your time. See, I've got a story to tell you. About crime and violence. Greed and vengeance. But it's also a story of redemption. Of second chances. Of change. I've planted three bombs where Gotham's corruption is at its strongest. But unlike those I fight to overthrow, I believe in choice. So, I offer you one. Let them detonate, or stop them. Your actions will determine what I do with you. Whoa, whoa, easy now. I ain't looking for a fight. Got a message, that's all. Anarchy says if you're gonna make a withdrawal, you better do it soon. Corruption is at its strongest. But unlike those I fight to overthrow, I will be Shiny, overpriced television reduces you. Imagine if we could 
could accomplish. If only someone would set us free. We can't beat that. Cops investigating this crime should have a relay station set up. It'll look like a mobile satellite dish, probably on a rooftop. Rubio, what's your 20? On the balcony for a smoke with a menace. Men on the balcony. That could be my way in. Shut case. Penguin murdered Black Mask and his lady friend. I mean, we found the bastard's stubby little fingerprints right by the body. Yeah, we got Penguin now. Like to see him. No need to call this. Black Mask. But why would he send me here if he was the killer? It doesn't add up. This crime took place days ago. The fire and the exposure to the elements make identifying the victims difficult. The male victim is wearing a black mask, but I can't positively identify him as Roman Sionis without a DNA analysis. Something I can't do in the field. I can identify the female victim based on her fingerprints. Tiffany Ambrose, Roman Sionis' girlfriend, or one of them at least. She was no angel, long list of priors, but nothing to indicate she was the target here. The fire spread as a result of a Molotov cocktail thrown into the room. It may have been intended to destroy evidence. The shallow trajectory of the bullet suggests the shooter could be someone of Penguin's height. But the grooves on the floor suggest that the victim was killed by someone leaning back in a chair. This bullet was fired from a revolver. Ballistics analysis indicates a low angle of trajectory. The shooter could have been someone of Penguin's height. But the pattern in the gunpowder residue suggests the bullet was actually fired by someone lying on the ground. These fingerprints are a match for the penguin, but they're on top of the soot from the fire. The cops were right. Penguin was in the room, but these prints prove he was here after the murders were committed. 
If he didn't kill Black Mask, who did? The only thing I know for certain is that Tiffany's shooter was lying on the floor. But why? These white streaks are shoe polish. Whoever shot Tiffany was being dragged along the floor. Besides the victims, there were two other people in the room. Tiffany's shooter, and whoever was dragging the shooter. The location from which the male victim was shot may tell me more. The DNA here doesn't belong to either of the victims. Whose is it? The fight broke out when someone startled the shooter. It's not clear who won the fight. Could have been either one of them. I should review the evidence to see if I can learn anything more about either the intruder or the shooter. Fabric analysis indicates the intruder was wearing a white suit or sport jacket. This fabric swatch could help identify the intruder, but I still can't identify the male victim's shooter. There's one impact area I haven't checked for clues. This DNA is from the female victim. The level of oxidation suggests it's been here for several days. If I review the evidence, I may be able to find out what she was doing when she was attacked. She was sending text messages to Roman Sionis about someone named the Joker. Someone killed Black Mask, but this crime took place several days ago, and I saw Black Mask earlier tonight. The only answers I have raise more questions. Who is the Joker? Was he the killer here, or is he one of the assassins? I have a body, an unknown shooter, and an unknown assailant who attacked the shooter. I need to match the DNA samples against the records in the National Criminal Database to identify who was in the room. Alfred, I need access to the National Criminal Database. Well, the only way to do that would be to infiltrate the Gotham City Police Department. Then that's where I'm going. Sir, you'd need to physically hack into their servers. If you insist on doing something that foolish, you'll need a powerful, non-lethal weapon. I recommend coming back here to pick up your concussion detonator. Not a bad idea.
Welcome home, sir. The concussion detonator is on your workbench. Remember, if you use that instead of your fists, you'll do less lasting damage to those police officers and civil servants. Noted. Well played, sir. You stopped the electrocutioner with a single strike. I just used his arrogance to my advantage. A textbook move a child could have avoided. True, but I doubt the rest of them will go down as easily. If they do, we'll be eating that Christmas ham sooner than you think. Understood. Thanks.
Watch the smoke traps. Ha, 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 ha.